We hear in Psalm 148, Praise the Lord from the earth, you sea monsters in all deeps, fire and hail and snow and frost, stormy wind fulfilling his command, mountains and all hills, fruit trees and all cedars, wild animals and all cattle, creeping things and flying birds. Surely creation praises the Lord. One thing I've noticed during this sheltering in place is that with fewer people out and about, animals are coming back. Here in Skokie, my nemesis are the rabbits, but it's not just here. In Cape Town, South Africa, penguins are strolling through the streets. Mountain goats have descended on cities in Wales, and in India, the Himalayas are clearly visible for the first time in 30 years. I think perhaps we can see this time is a gift that creation itself has been able to be still and breathe again, and all creatures have a chance to, to thrive when otherwise they have not. And God wants us to praise him with this creation and to see God's love and joy and even humor in his created creatures. Martin Luther says, God's entire divine nature is holy and entirely in all creatures, more deeply, more intimately, more present than the creature is to itself. Take time to enjoy the beauty of God's creation, to see God's skin. Be well, dear church.